much about organosilicon compounds let's summarize them finally as a matter of group now the trimethylsilyl group which is uh, usually known as the form tms it is a functional group in organic chemistry and this group consists of three methyl groups bonded to a silicon atom which is in turn bonded to the rest of the molecule this structural group is characterized by chemical inertness and a large molecular volume which makes it useful for a number of applications the compounds with trimethylsilyl group are not normally found in nature so uh, scientists or uh, more appropriately chemists sometimes use uh, it as a trimethylsilylating reagent to uh, derivate rather non volatile compounds like many alcohols phenols or carboxylic acids by substituting a trimethylsilyl group for a hydrogen in the hydroxyl group on the compounds this way the trimethyl siloxy group is formed on the molecule a couple of examples of trimethyl silylating agents include trimethyl silyl chloride which we have already studied bis trimethyl silyl estamide and so on so trimethyl silyl groups on the molecule have a tendency to make it more volatile often making the compounds more Uh, useful to analyze by gas chromatography or mass spectrometry an example of such trimethyl silylation is uh, usually shown in many of the uh, places and finds an application in most of the industrial scales when attached to certain functional groups in a reactant molecule trimethyl silyl group may also be used as temporary protecting group during chemical synthesis or some other chemical reactions now in chromatography uh, derivatization of accessible silanol group in a bonded stationary phase with trimethyl silyl group is referred to as end capping end capping means that is the protection of terminal group this kind of reactions we have studied earlier under the same heading now in an nmr spectrum signals from atoms in trimethyl silyl group is um, the in the compounds is commonly having chemical shifts close to the trimethyl silane uh, which is used as a reference peak now and uh, also compounds such as high temperature silicones uh, greases which have polysiloxanes or they are commonly known as silicones which you must have earlier studied of also in them they commonly show peaks from their methyl groups having nmr chemical shifts close to tetramethylsilane standard peaks otherwise very reactive uh, molecules they may be isolated when enveloped by bulky trimethyl silyl groups so this effect is also observed in tetrahedrons so this was in short the uh, majority of uh, application or usability of the organosilicon compounds which we have been studying for these days